Welcome to Dead by Daylight. Chosen for their unique talents by an ancient evil known as the Entity, killers must understand the rules of the hunt to achieve their ultimate objective. Sacrifice the survivors until none remain. To accomplish this, you will chase down, capture, and hook survivors before they can escape the trial grounds. But first, you'll need to find them. Survivors will attempt to escape using exit gates located on the edges of the map. To power the gates, survivors must repair five of the seven generators scattered across the map. Maps in the Entity's realm change each time you play. Neither the survivors nor the killer know what to expect and will begin each trial on equal footing. Drawn to these generators like moths to a flame, they're the perfect place to begin your hunt. Patrol unrepaired generators marked by a red aura in search of your next victim. Impede progress and extinguish hope by damaging partially repaired generators. Keep an eye out for loud noise notifications. These are created when survivors fail generator skill checks or perform rushed actions. If only one survivor remains, an escape hatch will open somewhere on the map. An open hatch creates an ambient sound. Find it and close it before the survivor can make their escape. Closing the hatch will power the exit gates, even if generator repairs have not been completed. Exit gates take some time to open, so use these final moments wisely to locate the remaining survivors before they can slip through your grasp. Once an exit gate has been opened by the survivors, or you find and close the escape hatch, a countdown will begin culminating in the endgame collapse. Any survivor remaining in the trial when the countdown ends is claimed by the Entity. Once a survivor is in your sights, expect them to do the only thing they can. Run for their lives. Their fear feeds your pursuit as running survivors leave temporary scratch marks in their way. Use them to your advantage before they fade away. Should the trail run cold, hiding in nearby lockers can often serve as the last resort for the desperate. Be wary of fixating on a single survivor. Focusing for too long on one survivor means more time for the rest to achieve their objective. Though most killers move faster, survivors are nimble and may elude you by quickly vaulting through windows, stunning you with pallets, or blinding you with flashlights. Don't let survivors dictate the chase. Instead, strategize your own path to stay one step ahead. Once you land your first hit, survivors will enter the injured state. Should they elude you, Track them more easily by listening for grunts of pain or following their trail of blood. Land another hit and they will enter the dying state. Collect them from the ground before their allies can help them to their feet. Move quickly. Survivors will fight to free themselves from your grasp. Multiple hooks are located throughout the map. While hooks can break, or be sabotaged by certain industrious survivors, the unique set of hooks found in each map's basement are indestructible. In the basement, there is only one way in and one way out, making rescue even more dangerous. Once impaled on a hook, survivors begin to lose health. In most cases, they will be forced to rely on an ally to rescue them. If the survivor is hooked a second time, you'll force them into a struggle for survival against the entity itself. If help fails to arrive, or should they be freed and hooked a third time, the sacrifice is complete. While the goal for all killers remains the same, 
Each killer is gifted with a unique power that offers them a singular approach to the hunt. Powers are as unique as the killers that wield them, from terrifying supernatural abilities to gruesome weapons, traps, poisons, and other means of inflicting devastation. Variety is the spice of death. Experiment to find a killer whose power matches your playstyle and maximize the torment you deliver in each trial. As a killer in the Entity's realm, you stand alone. An apex predator surrounded by prey. Your prey may prove cunning, but remember these basics and take one step closer to mastering the art of the hunt in Dead by Daylight. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe for more updates.